or meditation. As Kevin Samakad. Amen. Amen. Honorable members, it is with profound sadness that we formally note the passing away of Mrs. Agnes Sibisi and to Honorable Miss Linda Songwamazala, who will be led to rest on Saturday, the 6th of June, 2020. The funeral service will start at 10 at the Lutheran Church in Eden Day. Honorable members, may, as we may all be aware of that, of the passing on of, of the people as a result of the pandemic of COVID-19, with that understanding, we know that families are beginning to suffer as a result of losing their loved ones. In some families, the persons passing on are breadwinners. We are mindful that any loss of life at any given time and under any circumstances is one too many. May we continue to put the departed souls, their families, friends and colleagues, and whoever is in their social circle of influence in our prayers during this difficult time that we are all going through. May we also give a moment of silence for those who have departed. May their souls rest in peace. Honorable members, today's sitting is meant to deal with voting on the Wazulu Natal Appropriation Bill 2020, following budget debates conducted by the Committee of the Whole House through its extended committees. On ruling on virtual sittings and voting, Honourable Members are reminded that this virtual sitting will be conducted in terms of the rules of virtual meetings read with our existing standing rules. In terms of Rule 6 of the rules of virtual meetings, the quorum requirement of virtual sittings of the House are as provided for in the Constitution and the Standing Rules of the Legislature. Standing Rule 44 of the Standing Rules provide that at least one third of all the members of the Legislature must be present to constitute the plenary meeting of the Legislature. Rule 442 further states that a majority of the members of the Legislature must be present before a vote may be taken on a bill. The rules of virtual meetings also define present as follows. Present means the attendance of a member in a virtual meeting by electronic means in a manner that allows the member to join and participate. The secretary has confirmed that we have the required one members present in order to vote on the appropriation bill 2020. The sitting is therefore properly constituted. Rule 7D of the rules for virtual sittings also state that the presiding officer must, before or at the start of the discussion on the matter, expressly inform members if the party will be taken. In line with the above, I confirm that voting on the appropriation bill 22 will be done on a party by party basis. A party vote is a collective vote on behalf of all members of the party present at this virtual sitting up to the total membership of that party in the city. I will, however, allow an opportunity for any individual member to vote differently from his or her party or to abstain if any member wishes to do so. Uh, on, on apologies, honorable members, we have received the following apologies. Honorable Ms. M. Tully attending the FLC hearing and Honorable M. Kuala due to family commitment. Honorable members, I want to take I'm, you I'm, I'm back, Chair. I'm back, Chair. Oh, thank you, Honorable yes. Kuala. That, that apology is fallen off. Honourable members, I want to take this opportunity to wish a happy belated birthday to all honourable members who have had their birthdays in the previous month. Honourable J. N. Pele celebrated her birthday on the 3rd of June and wish 
And we wish in advance the following members will celebrate theirs in the coming days and weeks of June. Honorable O. Chikunene, whose birthday is on the 7th of June. Honorable B. Jangase, whose birthday will be on the 10th of June. Honorable N. R. Ntembu on the 12th of June. Honorable S. M. Sonjita on the 15th of June. Honorable N. N. C. P. Dasapeta on the 16th of June. Honorable A. G. Mapena on the 16th of June. May I take this opportunity to wish all of them well now and beyond. Honorable members, let's move to item number four, announcements or reports by the Premier. Honorable Premier. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, we wish to take this opportunity to make the two following announcements. The first announcement on the past Monday, Ukos FM, one of the radio station which is listened by more than 7 million people in South Africa, which also reaches some of the countries outside South Africa, including in Africa and overseas, turned 60 years. We take this opportunity to salute all of those who have contributed to the growth and development of Ukozi FM. We thank them for the role they have played in profiling our talents and preserving the culture of our province one of the fundamentals that the fundamental success they've scored is to ensure that they provide talent that would have not been recognized before. My last announcement, Honorable Speaker, we wish to take this uh, House into confidence that as KwaZulu Natal government, we're not going to take any risk in the opening of the schools. We are mindful of the need to ensure that schools are opened, but we are equally mindful of protecting the lives of our kids as well as educators. We are quite inspired by the work that has been done by the department together with the unions and school governing bodies in ensuring a proper preparation for schools opening. As I conclude, the schools that were supposed to be opened by this coming Monday are 6,148. I can confirm that 5,970 schools are fully ready to open on Monday and have received proper personal protective equipment they have ensured installation of water tanks and we have also they've gone through as the mining of ablution facilities we however plead with members of this house to ensure that they also play a supportive role on this work of ensuring firstly the protection of our leaders and educators but secondly ensuring that we support the education, so that the learners will complete this academic year. With that, Honorable Speaker, I thank you. Thank you, Honorable Premier. We now move on to tables. We have received the following tables uh, from the Department of Cooperative Governance and Traditional Affairs. Abakulusi Municipality 2018-2019 Annual Report and Annual Report and Oversight Report. The Oversight Report for 1819 for Endumeni Local Municipality. Nongoma Local Municipality Annual Report for 1819. Are there any other tables that have not been yet recorded? Is there any table? Thank you, Honorable Members. May we move to item number six, formal motions or notices by the Chief Whip, Honorable Chief Whip. 
Thank you very much, Honorable uh, Speaker. Uh, Honorable Speaker, there are no formal uh, motions and notices from our side. Thank you very much. Thank you, Honorable Chief. We, honorable members, now we move to orders of the day, which will be the voting on the KwaZulu Natal Appropriation Bill 2020. Honorable members, we will now proceed with this uh, voting on the KZN Appropriation Bill 2020. In terms of standing rule 2242, the question must be put in the following order. The program within a vote or where a vote comprises more than one program, all programs within that vote, the vote itself and the bill itself. Divisions recorded of opposition and declarations of vote. Members are reminded that in terms of Rule 12BV of the rules for virtual meetings, the rules pertaining to divisions do not apply to virtual meetings. There will therefore not be any divisions. There will be allowances for recording of oppositions on any programs of vote. There will also be allowance for a declaration of a vote at the end of the debate. Recording of opposition. The office of the speaker has received a request for a recording of opposition to various programs from the DA and has not received any similar request from any other party. As there is no deadline for this request, parties are still free to do so. In accordance with this past practice, all recordings of oppositions will be dealt with immediately after the question has been put on the particular program within the vote in which a party wishes to record its opposition. On declarations of vote, the Office of the Speaker has received a request on the to address the House for three minutes after the question on the entire bill has been put. I have not received any written request for a declaration of vote from any other party. There is no deadline for submission of such a request as is customary. I will, after the bill has been voted on, permit all parties to make a declaration of vote in terms of Rule 832 if they wish to do so, starting with the IFP, then DA, EFF, NFP, MF, ACDP, ATM, and the ANC in that order. Voting procedure. Honorable members, I will now go vote by vote and program by program without reading out any figures. Once the House has voted on each program, I will put the vote as a whole to the vote. As indica I indicated prior to the start of the debate, I will now go party by party to obtain the vote and thereafter check if any member wishes to record any, an individual vote. On vote one, Office of the Premier, those in support of program one, two, and three, IFP. IFP. Uh, honorable, honorable Speaker. Yes. Honorable Speaker. Yes. No, we, su we support. GA. We do support. Uh, support speaker. DA. Support speaker. EFF. EFF are not in the house. NFP. NFP is not in the house. MF. We support speaker. ACTP. ACTP is not in the house. ATM. ATM is not in the house. Support speaker. Oh, now the, the ATM is in the house. ANC. ANC support speaker. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party? Mm -hmm. I wouldn't know when well, someone just... raises their hand like that. I think it might be better that you just press and say your name. I see someone raising their hand. Honorable Tellezi.
Honorable Buteles, please unmute your mic if you want to speak. Honorable Buteles, unmute your mic. You are not unmuted. Honorable Speaker. Yes. I, can you hear me now? Yes, you are you I'm, have, I'm you very sorry, Honorable Speaker and Honorable Members. I was not against, I was fully supporting. I didn't know that my Honorable Kuala had already supported. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Speaker. Sorry about the delay. No problem. Thank you. Honorable Members, is there any member who wishes to express an individual yes. vote that is different from their party to vote or to abstain? No. There is none. Secretary, can I ask for the tally of the votes? I'm giving the secretary to tally the votes. Honorable Manuela, you are back in the house. Honorable Manuela. Honourable 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 Speaker. Yes, Honourable Member. Uh, uh, Honourable Speaker, this is a sort boy. There are members who are begging to join the to join this group. Can the IT assist them? Who are those members? Honourable Tagani uh, Pondombela, Honourable uh, Honourable Sonjita. I don't know whether the chief whip has also has joined already. No, the chief whip is here. We can see. Chief whip, Honorable Sonjita is here. So, Honorable Tombela. Who's not here? Yes. Okay. It is assisting him. I'm Zin. I'm Zam. Honorable Les Governor is also here, Chair. I see you, Honorable Governor. But the thing is, when people started announcing that they are here, we have to go through once more. You were recorded as present anyway, yourself. Can you see me? Can you see me now, Honourable Speaker? Honourable Mangale is here. Honourable Mangale. Yeah, we'll speak. You did yeah. not vote when we were asking you. Then we thought that you were not here. We you joined us. Yeah. We were voting. We were voting for program. Uh, vote one, Office of the Premier. Programs one, two, and three. Yes. Do you support or not? Yes, yes I do. You support? Okay. Yes, okay.
certeza. And here the speaker. Well, I got mind you. <clears throat> no, I, we have to recount Honorable Premier because other members were voting per party and other members came in when we were in the process of the county. Thank you. Yeah, well. Yeah. Thank you. The 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 yeah. secretary of the votes. Thank thank you, Madam Speaker. We have sixty six members in support. Okay. Okay. Don't have any against. Have absent some of the members. Abstention. There's no abstention. No abstention, Speaker. Honorable members, Honorable members, I get the result of the vote as in favor. Zero, zero abstention. It is recorded. Madam Hello? Speaker, on a point of order. Yes. Uh, Madam Speaker, I just want to bring your attention uh, to 7.2 of the virtual rules where it's a party vote. So I don't understand why we need to delay and take individual ballots cast. We're working on a system where we take a party vote and anybody that's opposed to the party uh, vote can then have their opposition recorded. So I'm not quite certain why we're having to count individual votes in terms of rule points uh, 7.2. But you can correct me if I'm wrong. Thank you, okay. Speaker. Thank you. Uh, you, you are not wrong. You are not wrong, but I think I must go to 7.2. 7.2 says that the president is elected to a party vote. Each party is called intent to cast its vote. The call is directed to the chief whip or whip or leader of the party. Remember that by chief whip or whip of, of, or party leader to cast them. Following the cast of the vote, the president of must ask if there are any dissenting votes or members who wish to record a vote that is contrary. The members must ensure that all votes are clearly expressed and recorded. That is 7.2. But when you go back to at the beginning, at the voting, party voting, it's of the total members of that party that mm -hmm. are present. Mm -hmm. We can't say that because DA has got so many members, we must also count members that are not present at the time. I'm trying to go to the exact exactly. rules. Exactly. Application, voting, voting in which may be personally per member or party vote at the election. A party vote is a collective vote on behalf of all the members of the party present at a virtual sitting or committee meeting, that's 7B of the virtual sittings rules on a Rogers. So we are required by 7B to not assume that when DA has voted, even on a Bumbali that is in, not in the House must be counted. We must count only the members of the DA. I am in the House, Speaker. Oh, you have arrived now. Mm, I was waiting. Oh, when you were counting, you have not arrived. Even, uh, even Kaula was. It? When we were voting, you were not around. Now we have done the counting and have declared the results. We'll move to the next one. We'll move to the next one. Then we will count you, Honorable Member. But I was implementing the letter in the spirit of Rule Seven B of the virtual rules, Honorable Rogers. Are you covered, my brother? Uh, I disagree, but allow me to disagree, and I'll I'll take your lead. Uh, you can carry on, Speaker. Okay, thank you. 
Members, for the sake of for the remainder of the plural and votes, I will simply ask if there is any party that wishes to vote again you know, or to record. I will not do that because now there have been members that have been added. We will have to note the parties that have been added. We will only be able to do that after vote, the next vote. Those in support of vote one as a whole, we will want to know that is we will go party by party. IFP in support of vote one as a whole. IFP. Then we we, we support the IP support the bill. And the number has changed. Now the numbers of the IFP has changed. There is a member that has come in. Honourable Kaula. DA. DA supports uh, vote one. Thank you, Speaker. EFF. The, the numbers will change because there is a new member that has come in again. EFF? EFF is still not in. NFP? Still nobody for NFP. MF? MF supports vote one, Speaker. ACDP? ACDP also supports vote one. ATM? AGM also supports vote one, uh, Speaker. ANC? ANC supports vote one, uh, Speaker. Thank you very much. It is recorded that vote two is supported. Cousin Bali, wait a minute. That's what I mean. Now we're going to, to vote two. Oh, the, the, the result is declared a 68 vote in favor and zero votes against and zero abstention. Now we're going to vote to the provincial legislature. Uh, those in support of programs one and two, we want to check, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have vote, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the programs are supported. We now still remain with 68 votes in favor, no votes against, and no abstentions. Those in support of vote two as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the whole vote. Members, I have the votes of all the parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the vote is supported. And the vote is 68 in support, zero against and zero abstentions. Now we're going to vote three, agriculture and rural development. Those in support of programs one, two, and three, I have received notice that the DA wishes to oppose programs one and two of vote three. Honorable Rogers, can you confirm? That is correct. Uh, thank you, Madam Speaker. Honorable Rogers says, well, then the opposition of the DA to programs one and two of vote three is noted and recorded. Is there any other party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Members, I have the votes. You have to, we have to count the votes then, uh, minus the votes of the, the DA. Fifty-seven, fifty-seven, four and against, and four and eleven again. Fifty-seven, 
Okay. Honorable members, I have the votes of all parties, which is 57, 4, and 11 against. Is there any member which wishes to express an individual vote? Oh, if I go that, who is there any member who wishes to e express an individual vote that is different from their party to vote or to abstain? Your vote was close, eh? Rogers, please. Ah, yeah, he called you the hands. Oh, sorry. Okay. If there is none, Secretary, can you tell you the votes? 57, 11. Uh, the vote in favor is 57, against 11, abstentions, none. Honorable members for program three, I take it that all members are in favor, is there? Honorable members, I therefore formally. Okay. Honorable members, can I take it that all parties are in support of vote of program three? Ne? Now, there is an additional member that has since joined, which is honorable declared to the IFP. We will keep. We want you to understand that we are not going to muzzle your votes. We'll keep updating when there is change in the numbers. Honorable members, I therefore get to the to announce that the on an order to get the honor the Miss Secretary to tally the votes for program three. Oh, for program three. Supported. It's all supported. It's 69. And now we're going to those in support of vote three as a whole. Is there a part, any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote three as a whole? Is there any party that wishes to vote against entire vote three as a whole? Yes, if there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of vote three. Yes. Members, I have the votes for all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or abstain? For vote three. Honorable members, the vote for vote three is 69 in support, zero against, and zero abstentions. Now we're going to vote for economic development, tourism, and environmental affairs. Those in support of programs one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the programs are supported. Uh, 69 in support, no opposition and no abstention. Those in support of vote for as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Honorable members, it is recorded that vote for is supported by 69 members, no opposition and no abstention. Now we're going to vote five education. Those in support of programs one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. I have received that notice that the DA wishes to oppose program six of vote five. Honorable Rogers, can you confirm? 
That is uh, correct, uh, Madam Speaker. The opposition of the DA to program 6 of vote 5 is noted and recorded. Is there any other party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Secretary, can I ask for the tally of the votes? Thank you, Madam Speaker. The member, members in support of the vote is 57 and 11 against program 6 of the vote. I then declare that the results for the other programs is 69 for program 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 7 and there's no opposition and no abstention. And for program six of vote five, there is 57, 4 and 11 against. So honorable members, all members are in favor, therefore, of programs one, two, three, four, and seven. That is 69 against Program 6 is 11 members. Let's go, Honorable Members. Those in support of Vote 5 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the Vote 5 as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that vote 5 is supported by 69, no, 0 against and 0 abstention. Let's go to vote six provincial program, the provincial treasury. I'm sorry, honorable members. Those in support of programs one, two, three, four, and five, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the programs are supported by 69, no opposition and no abstention. Those in support of vote six as a whole, honorable members, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Honorable members, it is recorded that vote six is supported by 69, no opposition, none against, and none have abstained. Let's move to vote seven, health. Those in support of programs one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I have received notice that the DA wishes to oppose program one of vote seven. Honorable Rogers, can you confirm? I confirm that's correct. Thank you, Madam Speaker. The opposition of the TA to program one of vote seven is noted and recorded. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? If there is none, Secretary, can I ask the value of the votes? Thank you, Madam. Thank Speaker. you, Madam Speaker. The voting, the voting results for the vote seven are as follows. 
Vote, vote, vote in favor. Vote against. 11. 11. There are no, there are no abstentions. So then, so three, two, three, five, 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 seven, eight, eight, four, eight, four, four members are in favor. So, for honorable members, 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 I declare the results of the vote as follows for programs two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. All members are in favor, which is 69 members, and no, none against, and no abstention for vote. I mean, for program one of vote seven, we have 58 in favor and 11 against. It is so recorded. Those in support of vote seven as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Mm -hmm. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the vote is supported. 69 supported vote 7 and no, none against and no, uh, uh, none abstained. Vote 8, human settlements. Those in support of programs 1, 2, 3 and 4. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Is there, if there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Honorable members, it is recorded that all programs are supported by 69, no opposition and no and none abstained. Those in support of vote 8 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Of the vote. Mm -hmm. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain for vote 8? It is recorded that the vote is supported by 69 members with zero opposition and zero abstains. Vote 9, community safety and liaison, those in support of programs 1 and 2. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Those in support... Oh. The pro programs one and two of vote nine are supported by 69 members, none opposed and none abstained. Those in support of vote nine as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Mm -hmm. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to, ex or to abstain? Honorable members, it is recorded that vote none is supported by 69, no opposition and no and none abstained. Let's move now to vote 10, sports and recreation. Honorable members, those in support of programs one and two, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs one and two of vote 10? Hey, Anissa Tulanga. Is, if there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have vo the votes of all parties is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? 
Yes, um, it is recorded that vote nine is supported by 69, no, no uh, opposition, and no abstain, no, none abstained. Those in support of vote 10 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Mm -hmm. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that vote 10 is supported by 69 without any opposition and none have abstained. Honorable members, let's move to vote 11, cooperative governance and traditional affairs. Those in support of programs 1, 2, 3 and 4, I have received notice that the DA wishes to oppose programs 2 and 3 of vote 11. Honorable Rogers, can you confirm that? That is indeed correct, Madam Speaker. Thank you. Thank you. The opposition of the DA to programs 2 and 3 of vote 11 is noted and recorded. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? I will never get discipline though. Okay, I have just noticed, we have just noticed that the EFF has just joined us. Honorable Sacha. Honorable Sacha. Honorable Sacha of the EFF. Honorable Sacha. We are on record that we try to speak to Honorable Sacha about the voting, but we try to speak. Honorable EFF. Okay, so we can record the numbers. Okay. okay. And then it means that he is not even here. Uh, if there is none, Secretary, can I ask for the tally of the votes? Speaker, the voting results for programs 2 and 3 of vote 11 are as follows. Votes in favor, 58. Votes against, 11. Abstentions, no. For programs 1 and 4, all members are in favor of the program. Okay, the votes for... The vote, the votes for votes two and three of eleven is fifty-eight in favor. in favor and eleven against, and for one and four. For the one other one. is sixty-nine and nothing. Honourable members. Those in support of vote eleven as a whole. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that vote 11 is supported by 69. Now we go to vote 12, transport. Those in support of programs 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. 
Honorable members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party? It is recorded that program 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 of vote 12 are supported by all 69 members. Those in support of vote 12 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition of, to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? To abstain? It is recorded that the vote is supported by 69. Now, honorable members, we are moving to vote 13, social development. Those in support of programs one, two, three, four, and five, is there any parties that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the program for all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Honorable members, is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the programs are supported by 69 members. Those in support of vote 13 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the of vote 13. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? If there is none, it is recorded that vote 13 is supported by all 69 present members. Honorable members, let's go to vote 14, public works. Those in support of program one, two, and three. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the programs are supported by all 69 present members. Those in support of vote 14 as a whole, is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to vote 15 as vote 14 as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party? vote or to abstain it is recorded that vote 14 is supported by 69 we now move into vote 15 arts and culture those in support of programs one two and three is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the programs if there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the programs. Members, members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? Secretary? Thank you, Madam Speaker. The votes are now 70. We have an additional member from the ANC that is joined. So it's 70 in support. It is recorded that 70, that the programs are supported by 70 members. Those in support of 
vote 15 as a whole. Is there any party that wishes to vote against or record its opposition to the vote as a whole? If there is none, it will be recorded that all parties present are in support of the vote. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party vote or to abstain? It is recorded that the vote is supported by all 70. That concludes, honorable members, that concludes voting on all the programs and votes. Now we move on to voting on the bill itself. Honorable members, those in support of the KZN Appropriation Bill 2020, I will also again go party by party. IFP, are you in support of KZN Pro Appropriation Bill 2020? Honorable Speaker, the IFP uh, do support the bill. The DA? We support the bill, Speaker. The EFF? It's still not here. NFP? It's still not here. The MF? The MF supports the appropriation bill 2020, Honorable Speaker. The ACDP? Yes, Madam Speaker, ACDP support uh, the bill. The ATM? Yes, Madam Speaker, the ATM supports the bill. And the ANC? Honorable Speaker, the ANC supports the bill. Members, I have the votes of all parties. Is there any member who wishes to express an individual vote that is different from their party? From their party vote or to abstain? If there is none, Secretary, can I ask for the tally of the votes? Speaker, the voting results are as follows. Votes in favor, 70. Votes against, no. Abstentions, no. Honorable members, I therefore formally declare the result of the vote as follows. Votes in favor of the bill is 70. Votes against the bill, nil. Abstentions, nil. It is recorded that the KZN Appropriation Bill 2020 is supported. That concludes voting on the bill. Secretary reads bill into the record. The KwaZulu Natal Appropriation Bill 2020. Thank you, Secretary. Members, I reiterate that the Office of the Speaker has received a request from the DA to address the House for three minutes after the question on the entire bill has, has been put. I have not received any written request for a declaration of vote from any other party. There is, however, no deadline of sub for submission of such a request. I will therefore permit all parties to make a declaration of vote in terms of Rule 83.2 if they wish to do so, starting with the DA because they've indicated that they may they want to make a statement. Then the IFP, if they so wish, the EFF, NFP, ACDP, ATM, and the ANC in that order. Can I proceed, Madam Speaker? Yes, Honourable Rogers, we are giving to you. Thank you, uh, Madam Speaker. I, I won't take uh, all my time, I don't think. Oh, Tulum Sendum. Oh, protection there, please, Speaker. Um, speaker, I think uh, the reason that we, we're opposing these particular programs and these votes is because if one looks at the, the debates that have happened, uh, and one looks at the, some of the challenges that we're experiencing, particularly in agriculture, education, health, and COCTA, there seems to be this, this mindset of denial that, in fact, there's nothing wrong and money gets spent effectively and we're dealing with issues in the province, which is, in fact, not the case. Uh, if you allow me just to highlight one, for example, and that is agriculture, which, as we all know, should be playing such a critical role in, in rural development and, and maximizing the potential of job creation and food sustainability. 
there was in yesterday's debate, all I heard was this absolute denial that agriculture, the department's running perfectly. There's no mafia in there. But if I just quote the the the, the previous MEC, uh, Honorable Ntembu, when he was there, and, I, and I'll quote his words, he, he made this comment. One of the major challenges faced by the department are the parasitic networks which have caused major damage within the department. Close quote. Now, that doesn't come from the DA. That comes from a member of the African National Congress. And he went on to say, and I quote again the Honorable Mtembu, we must also state that these challenges faced by the Department of Agriculture and Rural Development are not new and have been going on for almost two decades. I close quote. Madam Speaker, I don't want to go through each one of those uh, departments, but this is the frustration we find in opposition. When we highlight certain challenges and what we believe are failures, there's just this absolute denial. Instead of recognizing where we've got fundamental structural uh, challenges within our state and trying to address those, we try and sweep it under the carpet. And it's for that reason that we believe we need to oppose these six uh, program expenditures uh, where there is this failure to actually implement what is required. Uh, I thank you, Madam Speaker. Thank you. IFP, Do, if you wish to make. <clears throat> honorable Speaker, Honorable Premier and Honorable Members, as we have approved this budget today, which is yet to change due to COVID-19 impacts, we have signed a check to the executive. The power we hold in our hands which holds the pen in our fingers to sign this check is not our power. It is the power of the people of Wazir Natal. The check we have signed today to the executive of our province is not a blank check, but it has mandates and conditions, not only on behalf of the eight members of the legislature, but on behalf of the 11.2 million citizens of Wazir Natal. If anyone amongst all of us, including the administration, dares to think of enriching himself or herself illegally out of the positions of authority they occupy, always bear in mind that you are doing so at the expense of the people of this province. When you understand in transport why people do not have good roads in the rural areas in our townships, when you do not fill the vacancies on time, when we lose the national grants because you have failed to employ the unemployed, think of the thousands who go to bed with empty stomachs. When service providers you contract fail to honor the contract and do not send the fruits and PPEs they are paid to deliver to our children at school. When an old lady dies in a stretcher because the hospital does not have the appropriate facilities. When rural women continue to fetch water from where the cows and donkeys are drinking in the river. Think of the 11.2 million people of Wazuru Natal you are jeopardizing. These are the conditions and mandates of the check the IFP is signing to our executive today. The message the IFP gives the executive is deliver services. Let the people of Wazuru Natal benefit and see a change through this budget. As the IFP has approved this budget, Honorable Speaker, we want to place on record that the issue of norms and standards in the education department will be taken up as it disadvantages the learners and parents of Wazul Natal. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Uh, the EFF, thank you, Honorable Sabisa. The EFF, not in the house. The NFP, not I'm in the house. I'm MF. MF. 
Thank you, uh, Honourable Speaker. The MF uh, supports the Appropriation Bill 2020, as I have robustly uh, participated in various portfolio committees, oversight visits and debates, and given recommendations that the MF will monitor budgetary spend until, of course, the appropriations again this November. For the few debates that I missed due to clashes on this virtual system, like Boat 2, I want to thank the legislature staff, both the administrative and the IT staff, for their absolute commitment to make our lives comfortable and our work stress-free during the lockdown period to the finalization of the passing of all these budgets. Honorable Speaker, these dedicated men and women really need a dinner or a, or a lunch appreciation from yourself. That would be deserved fruitful expenditure. The debate that I really wanted to be part of was education, but I'm relieved that the Honorable Premier has assured this Honorable House of the safety readiness of those schools that are allowed to open for our learners and educators. This, of course, allays the fears of you know, hundreds and thousands of parents. Two recent banning issues, Honorable Premier, that has to be resolved soon are the blanket pricing in DSD and the missing PPEs in education. To the, uh, the, and I'm saying this because these are going viral on, on, on various platforms and they have to be resolved. The minority front has always believed in tracking performance and this is because we want service delivery to our people and this is supreme. With these words, the minority front therefore supports the appropriation bill 2020, mindful of these as well as other challenges. Thank you, Honourable Speaker. The LCDP. Uh, Madam Speaker. Amen. Uh, LCDP uh, recommends this budget. And uh, we are aware <coughs> that AG has also been given new teeth. And these teeth must be used to hold accounting officers responsible for corruption, wasteful, and irregular expenditure. Uh, we must be good stewards of our uh, provincial resources, which are entrusted to us. We must be servants of the people and not allow corrupt people to line their own pockets at the expense of the poor and of the poor. We as ACDP accept uh, the budget. Thank you, Madam Speaker. ATM. ATM. Speaker, as ATM, we support um, the bill. Um, Speaker, as is Ukulumakulumaba. The Kabanguchi um, Amakokas A2 are represented um, go, 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 committees wonke a corner. Conke Funasi Kulumas of Kulumama committees, Massens oversight as Pega Pambi, called on Obasas Vumilenje, Asazu Pega move on a pandeg as Funukov. Say a bonga speak. The ANC. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. <clears throat> Honorable Speaker, uh, leaders of the parties, especially Bulawayo, the leader of the opposition, all parties in the legislature, MECs and members of the legislature. Honorable Speaker, we wish to take this opportunity to thank all parties in our legislature who have supported the passing and the adoption of the bill. Of the, of the bill, the bill is not just for individual MECs, no departments per se, but for the people of KwaZulu Natal. We pledge our commitment to the legislature to remain transparent and accountable. No cent must be 
unaccountable for, and every program must be meaningful. We equally take to heart the words of the leader of the official opposition, that this is not a blank check, but it is a check that must go in line with the interest and the needs of the people of our province. We really would want to ensure accountability, transparency, but meaningful impact on the service delivery and in changing the conditions of our people. Honorable Speaker, we take note that all parties that derive their mandate from the poor and the previously marginalized have supported and adopted the budget, not because they are entirely satisfied. They have raised their concerns, and on behalf of the ANC as the ruling party, we commit ourselves to take those concerns seriously. We note the stance taken by the DA. We believe it is not just because they want to position themselves as the official opposition. We equally believe that it is not because of the prevailing internal power struggle within their party, where Africans are relegated to nothing as it is happening in Western Cape and in America. We are, however, willing to, con to engage with them on all concerns they have in each and every bill they have opposed. Honorable yeah. Speaker, I thank you. Nee, nee. Kindly check your phone. Thank you. Honorable. Nee, nee. <laughs> Honorable Premier, thank you. This concludes the item on the order paper. Can I ascertain from the Premier whether he has any announcements to make? Honorable Premier, any announcement to make? Honorable Premier. No, I'm muted. I'm muted. Who sent Are you are you having any announcement to make? Honorable Chair, thanks. We don't have any announcement at this time. Thank you. Thank you. Honorable members, the house business is now concluded. EFF and the visual workout opportunity to thank all of you, the honorable members, for supporting the virtual sittings and ensuring that the budget of the province of Kazunadal is passed. I want to thank all of you for the time that you have taken. We have been having long sessions. We appreciate that. I also want to thank the administration of the legislature for the extra hours that they have been putting in, but the That's support... Okay also ensured that we are never having sessions that end due to technicalities and glitches. We appreciate the work that you're doing. Indeed, you That's are right. the giant on, his, on whose shoulders we stand tall. The House is adjourned to see me there. Thank you.